Hi friends, it's Peanut. Today is Tuesday and it's been a long time, but I am going to the thrift store. I have three huge garbage bags that I have to donate. They're just items that I have no motivation to post or I, that I know I would get like $5 for only and it's not worth my time. So I'm going to donate those bags and I'm going to get a coupon and I'm going to go use it at the thrift store to buy stuff. Just got done but donating out now. My items, my siblings are leaving because they don't want to be in the vlog. But um, when you donate an item at Arc's Value Village, you get $10 reward on your next shopping trip. Um, so it's like $10 off. And you also get 200 points if you're like a rewards member. And if you gain, a, if the thing is like if you get a thousand points, you earn $10 off. So I'm already very close to that. So I am going to get about $20 off for my items that I purchased today so I'm pretty excited about that. My brother's helping take George out of the car seat and now we're gonna go into the thrift store and grab some items. Hi. You wanna say hi? Hi. Hi Dada. Today is 50% off pink takes. So my goal is to get pink take items or find things that are that I can resell for cheap. Thing. I got two bags of items, like shoes and clothing items, and some stuff I bought for myself. Um, so I didn't know that my thrift store was updating their reward system, so I didn't get my discounts off. But it's all right. I was gonna send up, save up a lot of money, but I didn't get to that point. But it's all right. So I paid fifty dollars. Or $49 total for all my items and I got a, some very good items in here so I'll go and do a haul when I get home. I'm debating if I want to go to another thrift store though. You guys want to go? Just go. Just go. Okay, so we're going to go to one more thrift store and then call it a day. <laughs> so we stopped by a small thrift store. I've never been here but it's a church thrift store. Um, Hopefully there's some good items in here. It does look a little dingy. So like my brother said, dingy stores are the good ones. But who knows? <laughs> thrifting at this um, church thrift store. I bought seven items and spent $28.43, which is not bad. Some items I bought for myself, and I even got a new lift tag J. Crew formal dress, so I'm pretty excited about that. But I think we're pretty much done for thrifting today, right guys? So to you. To you. me, I'm hungry. So we're gonna go eat, and then I will go home and show you the haul. Let's head home. Okay, so we are finally home and I'm gonna show you what I bought at the thrift store today. So first one is Art Valley Village. Um, I spent $49 total and I got a couple items. So the first item I got is this hinge. I've never heard of the brand before. It's a size six, it's a jean skirt with the button up, which I know is on trend currently. Um, I bought this for, I have my receipt in front of me. How much did I buy this for? Well, it was half off and 
and um, it was eight ninety nine, so about four bucks. Four bucks, four hundred dollar forty nine cents for this. Just not bad. I'll probably get around twenty dollars. I don't know. I've never heard of the brand, so I have to do a little research on the brand. Otherwise, I've learned my lesson. <laughs> Next is a ASOS size eight, and it's just a um, pencil skirt, a very vibrant red pencil skirt. Now it says a size eight, but wait, no, size four. Sorry, it was UK size eight, um, and I bought this for two dollars. And I really love the red, the vibrant red. It's beautiful. It's just simple and red. Next item I bought for myself. It is a athleta, oh, tough athletics size large. Um, workout yoga pants. I'm trying to buy bigger size now that's going to fit my growing belly. So I don't know, large might be too big for me still, but we'll see. I bought this for full price of $6.99. But since I bought this for myself, I'm not too concerned about the price. Next is a Zella, and I think this is an extra small Capri uh, workout pants yoga pants and this was half off so I bought this for two dollars and I think Zella is sold at Nordstrom Rack if I'm correct. Next item is another pants for myself another workout pants for myself it's a Zella size large paid four dollars ninety nine cents and it's still in very good condition and I need something that's going to fit my belly. So, got that. And then let's go to the dresses. What else did I buy? I bought this. I've never heard of the brand, but I like the style of the dress. Doe and Ray, size small. It's just this blue, super cute dress. And I bought this half off. So it was $3 for this dress. Next item I bought for myself. And it's a Liz Marine, Liz Lang maternity shirt, medium. Um, just a simple, simple gray shirt with a little pregnancy cinch on the back side to accommodate the growing belly. But I got this for myself and I paid the $2 for that item. And then um, I'm debating if I want to keep these myself or not, or resell them, but these are um, from Coco and Carmen. They're brand new with takes. Never heard of Coco and Carmen before, but they're brand new with takes. And it's a size, a small, and it's just these gorgeous velvet pleated dress. And it's like past your knee. It's super cute. I'm thinking I might wear them from like my photo session, but I don't know. Bought these for a dollar fifty only, dollar and fifty cents. So that's a really awesome, awesome purchase. And I bought, found one in the in um, a size small in the color black too. Also new with takes. Again, same price, a dollar fifty for it. Super cute, and I'm excited to either wear it or resell it. And then that's it for the clothing item. Next is the shoes. Um, so, as I kind of stated earlier in the video, I was excited about going to the thrift store because I have a rewards program with them where you spend so much, you earn so much points, you get a $10 coupon. And I was like 200 points away from that. And I was going to get a $200, 200 um, points redeeming for donating my items today and I was going to apply that and get my $10 coupon and so I picked these up thinking I was going to get them because these are Michael Kors for $10.99. Um, I didn't get the coupon but because they're changing their program um, but I got it they're like giving everybody 10% off just because of the um, whole error with the switching to the new car system. So I figured I'm still gonna keep pick these up because these are in like 
They're in used condition, but they're still very, very good. And they're just simple, cute Michael Kors heels. And um, just a little cleaning up that I have to do, but they're still very cute. Very cute, just some minor cleaning. And the soles are in very good shape. So I picked it up just because I figured I'll get my money back. And plus I will be getting a $10 coupon in the future, so I'm not too upset about it. Um, yeah, but these are the most expensive item that I purchased today and it was, if I didn't get the 10% for it, I would have never purchased it kind of deal. Next item are these Cliffs by White Mountain slip-ons. Um, what size are you? I don't know what size these are. It doesn't say on here. I'm about to do some digging, but um, these are leopard print, which are totally in right now. And they were half off, so I bought them for $3. And they're still in very good condition. First, the bonds. Last shoe that I bought from the store is a Dolce Vita. These are slip-ons, pointy slip-ons, and they're in this tan color, which is, in, it's so neutral in spring color. And I got these half off, so I paid $4 for them, which is not bad. I've never picked up this brand before, and there is a little bit of scuffing in the front, but I'll just disclose that in my listing. These, I think, are size nine sizing for this. I can't find it, but I'll definitely list it on my listing. So that's it for the first thrift store. The second thrift store is this um, church thrift store. My first time ever going there and I kind of like it. Um, everything is based off on a certain price. So every tag is blank and there's a huge list of pricing, a general pricing for all items. Um, there are some items that were pre-marked with prices. I didn't pick those up, of course, because those were overpriced. But those that didn't have that just have the, and that just had a plain take like this. Plain take like this, not priced or marked. I picked it up. And I think the sweaters were $3. Sweaters were three dollars ninety nine cents each, and which is pretty good pricing. So I picked this up for myself. It's a Gap. It's a so neutral, size large, and I love it. Very neutral color, which is what I'm all about nowadays. Next is this Cabby um, sweater. It's a tie up on the front. So where's the logo? I think I have it up backwards. Yep. So it's a cabbie, size small, and it's just a cardigan wrap, a tie in the front, kind of deal. And it's this vibrant red, and I love it. It's so cute. If anything, I want to keep this for myself, but I don't think I will. There's that. And I paid $3.99 for this. Next item um, is something I picked up for myself. It is from the brand Tribal. I've never heard of this. and I'm gonna do some price checking to see how much these run for. If it's something that's a little bit more expensive, I'll definitely just resell it. But I picked it up because it's a neutral color. Neutrals, and it has this adorable zip up decal on the back. And it has like the little flowy type of fabric. And I really love this. It's just kind of a pop of thing. And I'm hoping it fits my growing belly. So um, I paid $3.99 for that. And then this is like the best item that I found today, I think. Maybe. I'm not sure. <laughs> but I found this J. Crew size 2 dress at the thrift store, at the, um, that thrift store that I just went to, the Missions Revival. It is 
new lift tags, a new lift tag J. Crew, and I paid five dollars for this. So it's this gorgeous, like mauvey, peachy color, like peach, and it's just so cute, it's so formal. And it's the set season for all these formal wedding dresses, prom dresses, kind of events where people are wanting to buy like adorable dresses for events like that. So I picked that up and I know that I might get, I know I'm gonna get a good return on that. So I'm excited about that. Next is my first time finding this brand. I had to um, do some price checking while I was at the store, but it's Ruby Moon. It's a size large and it is sold at Anthropology. It's just this simple black, simple black uh, tunic sweater and it has this like little, I'm not, I'm not sure if it's going to pick up, but it has this like a little decal on the back and I paid $3.49 for this, which was amazing. I checked the pricing while I was at the store and they're running about I think they're like 20 to, 20 to 30 dollars sold. So just not bad for the price I paid for it. Next is a Zara. Zara. Which collection is this? I can't really tell. Zara We collection? I'm not sure. I can't really tell because it's like very light gray, very like light gray on gray, which doesn't help, but um, I picked it up. This sweater, it's a little floral sweater with these little full, full diamond and jeweled decoration on the, on the top of the front. And it's just a really nice sweater. So I picked that up for $3.99. And then, last item is this Banana Republic size small wrap cardigan um, in this purple color. It's so cute with the gray little accent. I'm debating if I want to keep this for myself because it, it will work perfectly with my belly. But um, we'll see. I don't know yet. And again, I paid $3.49 for this. So. That's all the items that I purchased. I spent $49 at the first thrift store, which is Arcs Valley Village, which is local to my state, and always, always have good deals there. Next is the new thrift store that I went to called Bibles for Missions. And um, I spent $28.43 for all the items, which is not bad considering what I got and the brands that I got. So. That's it for today's thrift store adventure and haul. Definitely make sure you like and subscribe and I shall see you on my next video. Bye-bye.